Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Minecraft YouTube. Let's continue on with our Minecraft <laughs> Please! <laughs> I think we've kind of both forgot that we were recording. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I was wondering why that too. Probably to make them more sexy looking. Probably, I don't know. Probably to make them look better, make them more appealing. Also, I have to ask because people don't know when I ask. Who was Twilight's main audience? Yeah, it does. Also, I didn't know that vampires don't breathe. They don't breathe. No, they don't breathe. Because in Twilight, they don't breathe. Because, I guess, because uh, when Belle becomes a vampire and talks to her father, they say, remember, you gotta pretend to breathe. So I guess they don't breathe? I guess they don't need to? I don't know. And then there's also like... I, so I, I understood the movie explained it. That vampires are not have children because it could throw, a, like throw the whole vampire community in the... Expose them all, but like, why? Like, what if they just put like made an education system for young vampires, like a prison kind of thing? I mean, yeah, it's not, that, that sounds kind of messed up saying put babies in prison, but I mean, it's way better than killing them. I don't, I don't know. It's been a while since I watched it. Yeah. I was forced to watch it. I think I was too, but I don't remember. There's, there's, there's a lot of questions to ask about Twilight that, one, I don't want to, two, I probably can't ask on YouTube. And that that movie that like where the whole daughter thing happens is makes me wonder what the whole target audience was. People that are fans of Twilight and teenage girls. No, you want to hear the one question, the one that I want to ask, what I feel like is like really weird to ask. What? What does imprinting mean? Did I turn my timer on? Yes, I did. My phone distracted me. I, I tried to get it out of my pocket. Good thing I put the... You know, bed down. Yeah, that's my most uncomfortable question is, what does imprinting mean? I really don't know. Look at it. I mean, because... I mean, to us, it means that basically, like, they're like, "Oh, you, I claim because you're like, you're my owner." But my whole thing about it is like, what exactly does imprinting mean as a werewolf? Yeah, I'm not wondering about that too. <laughs> there's so much. There's so much with, with Twilight. Thing, a 
Yeah, I, I don't know. There's a lot of confusing about Twilight. You, you know what? Ghost is probably gonna look at my video and be like, why are we gonna talk about Twilight? Well, he edits my videos, and most of the time when he edits it, he watches it. He's like, what was the... You know, why did I start talking about Twilight? No reason. Well, you, you're the one that started the whole conversation. I started talking... I think I started just by asking that why vampires burn in the sun. I don't actually know how we got on topic of Twilight. Because of me saying, uh, well, the Twilight zombies, not zombies. There's zombies now? <laughs> no, it's like a zombie. That's another thing that makes no sense. Why is there a movie about a zombie? There's a bunch of movies about zombies falling in love with humans and them having a relationship. There's a word for that. What? Necrophiliac. Oh yeah. Then again... Then again, technically zom some zombies aren't dead. They're just infected. Yeah. Which, that... Also confuses me because what makes it, what can, what how does infection work? Now I get sometimes if you get bit you can get affected because of the disease, but is it like what causes like what kind of infection causes it? Now some. Movies and games explain it. Uh, like Resident Evil. I don't think Resident Evil explains it. The movie does. Oh. I'm pretty sure Resident Evil, the, the game just like, oh, yeah, it's a virus. Yeah. The T virus or C virus. Yeah, that makes sense. But like, the one, the one that I like, because it's, it's like the most science is a zombie is created by like either being dead or being dead that I'm gonna talk about being dead part later because that's all two skeletons but usually what when they say zombies they're like oh yeah because it turns okay I'm going inside because it's not these skeletons are hurting me usually when they talk about zombies they're, they're saying that part of the brain that tells you when you're full, it's turned off. It gets infected. Which makes sense. How you. So I would imagine the virus that the zombie had gets sent to something. gets sent to someone else and turns off the same part of the brain. That makes sense. The thing. Okay, now. The thing I'm trying to figure out. When it talks about the zombie being dead. How is the zombie moving? Because usually, when people are dead, all the organs are removed. So, how is the zombie eating? Or breathing? Or doing anything? I'm thinking way too hard. To think this whole conversation started when I was asking why vampires started burning in the sun. Yeah. Today, this is... <laughs> this is basically just Minecraft podcast. Yeah. Escalates to twilight and to how zombies shouldn't even be able to be alive. Yes. Which I feel like it has been covered multiple times. 
feel like multiple people have covered the zombies that aren't supposed to be alive. Also, I'm just wondering, I, I don't understand, like, what, who decided that they wanted to make a love story about a human and a monster? And then a vampire or a bird. Oh, that's another thing. If imprinting was a whole thing, why couldn't he just imprint on Bell? Is that actually that actually explains a lot of movies? No, I hate to say it though, but tell me if I'm wrong. That would be a good that would be a good excuse for why like what was going on in uh, Wonderland. That's in the Wonderland. Yeah, that, that'd be a good excuse. Like I was seeing some stuff. I the drugs. Well, okay. But someone said that it probably could be schizophrenia, which I could also see that. Yeah. I don't know. I think I mean, was I the only one that like watching it? And I was like, I would not be happy to be there. I'd be terrified. You're thinking of Willy Wonka. I think it was game theory, no, film theory I think was talking about it, where Willy Wonka technically uh, messed up because in the, I think it was in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, I think it was, I think it was, I think it was the original one, yeah, where uh, Willy Wonka literally says, have fun, everything in this room is edible, actually he says it in both. But he says everything in the room is edible. And then he gets angry when someone starts eating the chocolate. It's like you said everything in the room is edible. Now, I'm not gonna lie though, the one Johnny Depp, they put a dark twist on it and it made me laugh. Because in the original, they just said everything's edible. And the one with Johnny Depp, he says everything's edible, even me. But that's called cannibalism. Wait, Johnny Depp did a uh... yeah. When? Um, I th it was the second one. It's the most modern Willy Wonka. Johnny Johnny Depp is Willy Wonka. And, and, I don't know. It was it was just it was just funny. Did you open the door again? Did you open the sliding door again? I hear a bunch of wind and you're quiet. Okay. Oh, it sounds better. I 
I do find that kind of funny. Like, he says everything in that room is edible. So, why not specify when you say that, except the chocolate? The chocolate is edible, but it's not meant to be touched by human hands. Then again, it's a room full of kids. I don't think they're gonna listen. Willy Wonka was that the kids don't listen. Except for Charlie. Yeah, that is true. Oh no, there's a, there's another thing that made me that made me laugh. They're like, how was Grandpa, I think his name was Grandpa John, the one that accompanies with Charlie, how was he able to walk after years of being stuck in the bed, unless he wasn't stuck in the bed, and was just lazy? Yeah, I think he was. Which? Oh, chocolate factory? Yeah, he just got right back, he just got right up. I mean, yeah, he did. He did stumble a little bit, but yeah, everyone would stumble a little bit if they've been sitting for like years. I like how fast I can change a topic, and sometimes it doesn't even make sense on how I changed it. How are you fighting zombies in midday? Uh. I found a cave that leaves the boat on. Also, like, I feel like those are very dangerous hazards, though. Think about it. All the w no. Well, it sure depends on which Willy Wonka we're talking about. The original one. All of them were kind of safety hazards, and that's why the kids uh, do end up in trouble or getting in danger. The original, the original one, no, not the original one. The second one, the one joined up. The squirrel one, not really a safety hazard because there is a gate. Then again, there might have been a gate in the original one. I haven't watched them in a while. I might rewatch them. Because now I kind of want to watch them again. Oh, that one! That one now I'm sorry to remember. Oh, you remember the one with Johnny Depp? Yeah. Oh, Yeah, that was Johnny Depp! No, that's Johnny Depp! And the only reason I knew that was Johnny Depp was because uh, I saw Johnny Depp's, like, one of his, like, earlier films. And I'm like, oh, he looks so young. And then I looked at uh, that one, and I'm like, wait a minute, he looks familiar. I, I, still, I still can't get over it. I still love Edward Scissorhands. Okay, I'm gonna, now that I think about it, I hate to, oh, I, I, I kind of hate to say it, I can't think of a single movie that Johnny Depp has been in that he hasn't made me laugh. He takes like, he takes like every, oh, I, well not everyone loves him, we learned that the hard way. Okay, I need another chest and my foot full of dirt. Which 
Do I have any planks in here? I do. Probably use the planks in the wood. Put them in the dirt in here. I might be able to fill up the chest full of dirt. You know, you know what I just read is kind of funny? Even though Ghost gave us permission to say his name, we still have yet to say it. I mean, recently. We said it before, but then again, I don't care, and neither does he. You think the original Willy Wonka movie is better? No, I think it's the original uh, Willy Wonka. Because <laughs> <laughs> the way he tried to stop the kids, he's like, <laughs> like Yeah, he was like, oh, he's like, no, stop, don't. I don't know. Johnny Depp's Willy Wonka gives me more of a serial killer vibe. Well, the original Willy Wonka, he's just sitting there. Meanwhile, the Johnny Depp Willy Wonka, he dances at, like as, as they're singing. It's like the kid's in danger, but this beat though. So, the giant. I like how we're just calling it original and Johnny Depp version. Yeah. But the Johnny Depp version, Charlie's father, like, he condoned, like, stealing. Also, why would you steal? Okay, I kind of. Some, some of the caps understand stealing because they're stuck together, but, like,. If you're gonna steal, why steal those? Or stop there at least. Oh, that's right, I broke my uh, I broke, broke my pickaxe, that's why I went back inside. I think my mother's at the door. I'm gonna go home and see. But yeah, like, they both seem like serial killers. But we got one who barely tried to stop him, the other, she was just dancing. Oh, if you, you want to get even worse about it? Because Johnny Depp's dancing, you want to hear what he dances to in Willy Wonka? A guy, a boy drowning in chocolate, which Phil Dury said that chocolate had to be kind of hot. A girl being mauled by squirrels. A girl being filled up into a blueberry. Does a kid get shrinking in the giant one too? But do you remember if he got shrunk in the uh, Johnny Depp one? I don't remember if he did or not. Give me back my shovel. No, he did. I remember because uh, his father carried him in his pocket, his shirt pocket. 
Yeah, the John Depp one was like, these people are all fine, don't worry. Wiley still gives me nightmares. Bro, in the Johnny Depp one, Violet becomes like Mommy Long Legs. Uh, you are having not such a good day. I would come rescue you, but I have no clue where you are. Um, there's a lot of desert. Yeah, but cave. There's also a lot of cave. <laughs> I don't know. I think one of the ones that John Deb like. No, you want to hear something that I think is impressive? Being able to make someone laugh without even talking. Only two people have done that. You want to hear about two people? Charlie Chaplin and Johnny Depp. We're both suffering, but in different ways. Thank you. Give me back. What they take. You didn't say anything in important with you, did you? No. Okay, good. Orbital Cannon. I feel bad for ghosts. I just realized something. He's gonna have to edit too. Oh, then again, he has two whole weeks to edit two videos, so that's fine. Plus, I, I do mostly editing anyways. Yeah, I'm the one that edits. Well, the way, the way it goes is I edit it from the main part, and then he just refines it. Wow. He adds the thumbnails and he makes it look good. to give him access to my YouTube so he downloads the videos and then he can edit it and basically put it back on YouTube wow. yeah I, I private them or schedule them he downloads them and then he edits them and then he puts them back well no he doesn't put them back he edits them before they they published which that stays the only, way, only reason only, he would have to the only reason he would have to um, uh, take them down is if he puts text in them. Really? I still find it kind of funny that the, the way we switched so fast. See, I thought they were just talking about vampires. See, they were, but now they're talking about Willy Wonka. See, okay. I honestly want to watch your video. Yeah, I'm, I placed down one torch and I'll tell you a whole bunch of fire. Right? Oh, because I want to see the difference. Because you, because when I went to Adventure, 
I was kind of getting attacked by everything, and you were just in your farm. So I'm breaking a wall over here. I want to see what you're going through. The worst I got was just skeletons shooting me while I'm building my farm. Not my farm, my wall. All I hear is torch here. Do not attack me, and I hear an arrow. It's like, what did I just say? I can tell. I have a lot of items. Okay, why is my pumpkin not growing? It should have enough room. Wow, it took all my arrows. I only have three arrows left. Well, I'm gonna put more dirt around it. I can barely see if I can still hit you. <laughs> my I, I there. <laughs> they have w a source of water, and they have a bunch of places they could put the pumpkin. So they should put the pumpkin. Actually, they don't need these. These they don't need because they can't. They have to do it next to them. So these I can keep back. I basically just did the exact same thing I had before. Oh well. <sighs> this doesn't look like it did before, but I think this is far enough. I'll make some cookies. I thought I could repair using cobblestone. What? It's the anvil that I have to use. I think it's anvil that I have to use. I'm probably being stupid. Yeah, I guess it is anvil. See? D. D? Yes. The skeletons need w vitamin D. They're white as a ghost. I still understand that. How can you tell if a ghost is white? What if a black person died? They're white as a ghost. But the guy that we're looking for. Black. Like in almost every movie, every movie. Ghost is depicted by either being uh, white, white or green. Green? Oh. Casper. It's like green. Well, Casper is white ish, green ish. But the brother is white. I was talking about um, Gooper from. I think it's Snape. I think it's Snape. From Ghostbusters. It's oh yeah. His name's Cooper. I just call him Batman. <laughs> okay then. It's a bad thing. It's a cat one. How many cookies can I make? I can make almost a whole stack of cookies. I can make fifty six. I can make 56 cookies. Actually, hold on. What gives yeah, more? Cookies or bread? Well, cookies cost less. It, and it gives more. So, two for eight or three for one. I'm gonna go make my hunger corner.
uh, funny part is, I don't think anyone, I don't think anyone understands what I say when I say hungry cor corner. In a lot of Minecraft games or like things, I put a, I made a corner where I could jump and lose hunger. So I can eat puffer fish or something. Actually, wait. I should probably wait. I should probably wait till I have no hunger. And I'll try one cookie and I'll try one bread. Because I want to know what is the best for feet. Actually, can I, I can probably just look it up. How much each fills. It's night time. There's my fishing rod. I don't know why I have this fishing rod here. I should probably switch it out. I don't know. Why are creepers responding next to me? Yeah, that happens a lot. I'm gonna go steal some eggs. Bangs or bangs? What? I said eggs. Speaking of eggs, I swear. What the heck? You are not having a good time. Maybe my chicks are in the hole. Maybe I shouldn't be in the hole! Nope, please let me in, please, please. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm good. So, you know the hole that leads into the cave under our house? Yeah, I dropped down it because I was going to look for my chicken. I interrupted a meeting. Want to hear who was in the meeting? <laughs> Three creepers and a fully gold out zombie. Yeah, and I'll have a stone sword. Wow. Can I cheese it? <laughs> I just realized I have a water thing in my house. Okay. Maybe I can drown all the mobs down there. Yeah. And there's a cave. There's a cave down here. Any mobs in this cave? Oh, hi. That's where I keep hearing the Enderman sounds. Oh no, oh no. No, don't tell me I s don't tell me you saw me. I don't know if I looked him in the eyes or not. Yeah, I definitely did. I made a hole in case I did accidentally look into it uh, Enderman's eyes in the cave. That's a lot of purple sparkles. I don't want to go down there anymore. You know what I wish? I wish that the torches worked like they did in, in um, I can't remember, there was one where they were. Basically one of the things that you could have is a good horror game where if you hold a torch, it gives you light. I know, but I wish, like, could you imagine how satisfying that would be? Yeah. 
There's all, I think and there's multiple mods for it, but the one that I like, it makes the torches brighter except for one small problem. They burn out. So you have to relight them. Isn't that a freaking candle mob? No, it's torches. I might die. Fuck you. <laughs> creep on my bridge. <laughs> Wait, on our bridge or your bridge? My bridge. Uh. Nowhere near the house. Okay. What is? Okay, that's weird. I looked at a wall inside my house and had a feeling that the sun was rising. That's weird. I know. <laughs> not dropping more, building more. Very dark. I should have brought a sword. Ooh, that's a creeper. Actually, yes. Hey, creeper, come here. Is that, Ru is that Ru not Ruby? I was gonna say Ruby. Is that redstone? Blow up, blow up, blow up. Thank you. I mean, Minecraft did have a. I, st I thought they did. bring a sword next to me. No. I thought... <laughs> oh, that is... I actually looked at it intermittent in the eyes so I immediately ran into the water. Alright, I'm going back up to get food. How much does bread? Do you know how much bread? How much hunger bread feeds? No. Okay. Also, I'll probably just. Oh, do you have bread? I found a potato. Oh, nice. Keep it. I know. Do you have bread? Cause you said hold up. I do. Okay. Two and a half. Bread fills at two and a half? Yep. Okay. Wait, did you only have two and a half hunger or how much hunger no, did you have? No, I had three. Okay. Bread's better. Wait. Technically, no? So if bread does two and a half, technically cookies would be better. Because bread does two and a half, but cookies do one. But with two wheat, you can have eight cookies. So that means that using two wheat, you get eight hunger rather than getting three wheat and two, only getting two and a half. But, if we do the math, 2 times 3 oh, would be no. 6, gotcha. so we're going to do that. So if we, yeah. Try me, I'm going to keep moving because my, cause Ghost said that he hates when I do math and just sit completely still. Actually, I don't, I don't care, I missed a bit. So, so 2, so 2 wheat gives you cookie, 8 cookies. So... 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, we have 24 cookies. That'd be 24 hunger filled. <laughs> two breads would do, you said two and a half, so it'd be four, be five. 
So in the long run, cookies are still better. But it's also delicious. But using the same but amount of wheat. Cookies. Yeah. Using the same amount of wheat, which is you we use six wheat. We have bread that gives five hunger because you get two breads. But if you do cookies, you get twenty four cookies, which has twenty four hunger. If you eat, if you eat all cookies. So make wise, cookies are better. Survival wise, if I'm like in a fight, bread's better. Did I really do all that math for no reason? Pretty much. Am I gonna make more cookies? Definitely. Am I gonna go back? Yes, I am. I'm gonna make as many cookies as I can. Am I gonna get lost? Hell yes. I am. I I have. 48 cookies. Is that all I have? I have a total of 55 cookies. Where is a chest? My heart chest? So I just took one. No, I didn't get a micro. Plus, if you do uh, actually want to go to the mansion that you said you want to go to, we might as well make rails to it. I already told you, I, I actually I gave someone the seat and they found one. Oh. Now, and again, I need to go look at it, because all they did was send me a picture, and they gave me the rough coordinates for it. So I might go find the exact coordinates for it. I'm probably going to die, but I'm, I'm going to risk it. I'm going to go grab my sword. Grab. Half my torch. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Uh, Did I scare you? No, I try to jump one block of a gap, but I'm in the cave and it's low, so I thought I'd jump and fail. It's my death. Hmm. Uh. No, I'm not gonna bring it. I was very tempted to bring my iron pickaxe, but I'm not gonna bring it. Because I cannot risk losing that. I cannot risk losing that. You seem to have a rough time exploring. You know, seeing how bad you are exploring, we should probably, we should probably, you know, prepare long and hard. What the f oh, that was thunder. We should prepare long and hard before we ex try to get some mention. Basically, can't put it on peaceful. But the potato. I know. I know. Okay. I'm just gonna grab. They took my damn sword. <laughs> they took your sword too. The zombie took my sword. I'm trying to get the potato. Get the potato back. I'm trying. To There's a horde of zombies. Yes, one of them pimped up with gold. Oh no! Here's a zombie, but I don't know where the zombie is. 
Does that concern me? Definitely. Oh, there's gold under my house, by the way. Oh my, that scared me. That was very loud. That's a creeper. But that was lush forest. I have to kill that creeper. But what do I, how do I do this? I know what to do. Come here, creeper. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Fight me. You stupid creeper. You probably smell like cheese. What? I don't know. No, no, no. You were supposed to... Well, at least I solved it a little bit. I want dumplings now. But, but dumplings. Oh, so that's really dark. Let's put a torch there. That's a lush forest. That's another creeper. If you could please either blow up the same place the other dude did, or come try this new ride. It's gonna make you blow up. Yep, blow up please. Well, yeah, it did basically what I wanted it to do. Did I really not build it high? Please, no more creepers. I just want to look at that lush forest. That's gravel. Ooh. Stairway? I made a stairway using gravel. I feel nice. scared me, but I'm happy. <laughs> I found a ruined portal. And then I heard thunder. And then two creepers exploded. No. <laughs> oh, do I investigate the... Ah, uh, no, I can't see you okay, well. Okay, I have an idea, I have an idea, I have an idea. I heard that creeper try to explode, and it exploded. I'm gonna get back in. I'm gonna get back in my house before I die, cause I don't want to like just like start and immediately be in a cave where I'm gonna die. You're doing another video? Until I get home, start relaxing. I guess I'm doing another video after I 
to be except this one. But as always, have an amazing day. I want it to be so amazing that you find a ruined portal in your Minecraft world. And as always, if you want me to have an amazing day, press like button or the subscribe button. I don't care which one, they both will be happy. And as always, I'll see you in the later video. Goodbye!